Unfortunately for you, Sandra, I was not bluffing. So, Susan, it's time for you to get your hands a bit dirty. You got a shotgun? I'm gonna have you attack. Unload that clip out there. Good, good shooting. Good, amazing shooting. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Sheltered. I'm your host, the Bunkered Bird, and his family known as Falcon. So, last video before we get underway over here today, uh, I mentioned if you guys wanted me to wrap up the series or wait for the update, or I gave you a couple of options. Um, and the majority of you guys mentioned Falcon, get the RV fixed up, and then take a break, and let's wait for the 1.7 update. And you know what? That sounds perfectly fine for me. I don't mind playing this game. I actually really enjoy playing this game a lot, so it's not a big deal for me. But I wanted to have an objective, and you guys overwhelmingly voted for RV, take a break, and then 1.7 update down the line. Now, before we get underway, as you see right here, I have a radio scanning result, and we actually found something. So my girl, reading all those books has paid off, so we found something here. We discovered someone in need of help. The map has been updated with their location. So, let's see exactly where this is at. If I go over to the map here. Let's zoom on out. So, we have... We, we've known about this trade caravan for a while. What did you just find? Up here? Super irritating guy? No, that can't be it. I think that guy was there before too, right? Or am I wrong about this? Maybe it is him. Well, I mean, I'm only seeing, like, two of them here, so that that probably should be it, right? Super... No, no, you know what? I don't think this is the guy that we had before. No, so this might be the dude we just uncovered just now, if I'm correct. I could be wrong. That could be the guy. Now, the problem is we're not here. So here's what we're doing. Since I need to find parts of the vehicle, we need to go to the scrapyards. And since we have four capable people now, you know what I'm gonna be doing? I'm gonna be sending out two parties at the same time now. So it's about to get really hectic over here and I'm kind of excited about that. So uh, the thing though is that we have to wait for Susan to get loyal before we can send her out. So once she's completely maxed out in loyalty, we'll have her and the boy take off and I'll continue rolling with Susan. Yeah, you're Anna. Okay, I gotta remember your name now. Got a new girl here, gotta remember her name, Anna. So I'll, I'll keep rolling with Susan or I might just go out with Anna instead and break her in. Giggity, giggity. I know, that's not what I meant. I swear to God, that's not what I meant. But, meanwhile, I do have the boy working on the punching bag over there. Uh, wife just came up above, or came down from above from fixing some stuff. We just caught ourselves another one of those bad boys. Girl, you go back to scanning for frequencies. Anna, you get loyal by doing whatever it is you're going to be doing. And I think everything else here in the base is just about fixed, right? Oh, she's actually cleaning them on her own. Anna is. Hey, well, good on you, Anna. Efficient shower, punching bag, shelter door. Ooh, the shelter door needs a little bit of fixing. So... I know you're going out without a suit, but you're just going outside right there, okay? It's not really a big deal now, is it? It shouldn't be a big deal. Alrighty. So, Anna. Loyalty went up a little bit here. Perfectly fine. Anna, can you help me fix stuff meanwhile, too? There you go. Help the wife out as she does this stuff here, and you'll fix that. You'll... No, don't, don't, don't take a shower. You're fine. Fix. What? What is it? What? Recycling center? Yeah, well, what's in here? I need some vehicle parts, dog. Come on, Falcon, keep your eye out. You're supposed to be a Falcon. You're supposed to have, like, a keen sense of vision and stuff like that. I need you to find these vehicle parts for me. The boy is tired from punching that bag, so it's time for you to get some sleep. Girl does her thing over here. No. Nothing was healed, I should say. Um, so, girl, you know what? Just go, meanwhile, and let's go back to Reed. Get a toy. Go back to reading. I want to make you even smarter so you could probably find some more stuff by doing that. Oh yeah, I forgot I made the coffee machine last time too. Let's do that. I, I, I was, you know, I mentioned that video that I was under a little bit of the gentleman drink. And I kind of forgot all the things I did here. Like I, the punching bag and this is new to me. So God knows what the hell else I said and did that video. Um, so how about we try this out? Brew coffee. All right. This is going to be new to me. Can we zoom on in here? I want to see this, uh, what's going on. Oh, I got a transmission as well. What is it? Medium house, search location, yeah. There you go. The wife is making some coffee. Ah, good old job. So what happens here? We only had one bean or what? We really only had one bean? I guess we only had one bean. So only one, one cup of coffee was brewed. That's it. It's really surprising. Well, what is it now? Medium house, right? Let's go inside. I mean, since we have a lot of inventory space right now, let's just go ahead and select everything. So, you know what? If we're going to have a second party, we're going to have to equip them properly. Meaning, we might have to make them a couple of vests. We already have masks. Uh, they're also going to need some weapons, too. Dedicated weapons for them. Right now, I've been rolling with a hatchet and a gun. So, I think we might do the same thing for 
the sun, and Anna over here too. So if that's the case, wife, let's come over to building. And let's see, we're gonna need to get two more bulletproof vests, which we luckily enough have a lot for that. So make one and make two. So that's good. Boyo, you go back to training here at the, at the bag. And you know what? All things considering, Anna, can you build for me as well? If you can, how about we make her a bag too and have her train meanwhile? Let's see, do we have enough for this? Oh yeah, we have plenty. Well, we're going through our wool, which I believe I need for another upgrade. Or something else in the base, but eh, yeah, well, we could get some more eventually, right? So let's make two punching bags here. Cool. Well, what is it now? Medium house, examine the items, sure. Take everything. Oh, we got some more coffee beans, excellent. We're about to turn our uh, little bunker into like a Java hut pretty soon. And actually, a Java hut is like a place that... What is it? I feel like a Java hut here, at least where I live, it's like a chain of like, you know, smoothie stores. Java hut. Which is kind of weird because Java is coffee? No, 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 I I'm wrong about this. Jamba Juice. Jamba Juice is the place that does flurry. So the Java hut... I think I just made that up. <laughs> is there a Java hut? There's gotta be a Java hut somewhere, right? I could have just made that up. And if there is no Java hut, I just gave you guys a million dollar idea. Go out there and create your own Java hut chain of coffee. There you go. I gave you a bunch of money in your pockets in case you want to make it happen. Uh, wife. So you've made what you need to do. Perfect. Let's see what else we need for these people going out. We got those. We're going to so we need two of these, right? And luckily enough, we have enough leather for that. So one. And... Two. Ah, ah, ah. Alrighty, so yes, that was the, uh, that was indeed the count. And now you get over here training as well. And, well, what is it now? Approach strangers at a medium house, go for it. Girl is tired, I'll have her get some sleep, and then she's gonna go back to just... Being smarter. Being a smart, being a smartass, really. That's what she's all about. Don't panic, I'm friendly, says the bird who's been killing people left and right. <laughs> I'm sorry to say, Sandra, you're about to get bullied. Well, I say friend. Really? That's your op opening shot? <gasps> oh man, Sandra is um calling me out on my bluff. Unfortunately for you, Sandra, I was not bluffing. So Susan, it's time for you to get your hands a bit dirty. You got a shotgun? I'm gonna have you attack. Unload that clip out there. Good, good shooting. Good, amazing shooting. Can you stop? You're wasting all of my ammunition. Are you kidding me? Did she go through all of my... I gotta look at my inventory afterwards, but I, I told her to unload the entire clip on this woman, and she missed, like, four out of five shots, was it? Now I have to kill her with Falcon. Look what you've done. I, I have enough blood on my hands, Susan. We have six more shells left over. That's good, at least, but good God almighty, did you see that? That was almost comical. Look at my trauma going up. This is all your fault. So, you know what? I think she did that purposely. She doesn't want the trauma. She wants to affect Falcon. I think she's like planning a coup. <laughs> she wants me to go crazy and then she'll take me out herself in the name of like, you know, putting me out of my misery. And then um, she wants to take over the base. Imagine that. The alpha male is about to be brought down by one of the people he brought in. And then, you know, I can't even expect my boy to take over properly. He, he's, a, he's a bit of a coward, you know, let's just be honest here, you know? He just hangs out in the base the entire time, punching a bag. He can't take over what I was doing. Susan's over here just working quite a bit of an angle, I gotta tell you. You go back to sleeping here. Heidi, wife has made the rucksacks for us. Is there anything else that we need for these trips? Uh, gotta make sure we have enough weapons too, right? Which I should. But let's make double... Let's do a double check here. So here's my rucksacks, here's my bulletproof vest for next two people. And we have hatchets left over, we got guns. Oh yeah, we're fine. We're perfectly fine. So, if anything, we have dirty water up above. Yeah, yeah I did tell him to search for that, right? Coffee. Oh, look! We have ten coffees now. Oh, so it was brewing initially, and now we can come in here and drink it. Hey! That's pretty gnarly. Um, okay, so we have ten coffees ready to go. Let's zoom in. Oh, look at that. It's actually filled up. Um, go and drink some coffee. What does a coffee do? It's for stress and thirst, if I'm right. It's like a two-pronged effect. Large house. Yeah, let's uh, take whatever we can here, which should be... Oh, just about everything. But we're out. Oh, we're out of space now. Ah, rah, rah. Ah, rah, rah. Okay, what can we leave behind? I don't need these matches. I'll take that instead. And what else is kind of pretty much garbage at this point? Maybe the limestone? No, the, the bag for a fact. Don't need no grocery bags to carry stuff around. 
Uh, Boyo, let's just continue training over and over. I should... Oh yeah, we could have him jump from one to the other one. Right. That is what we'll do. Are you guys looking pretty fine? Looking pretty good? Pretty fly? Everyone's looking pretty fly. Pretty goosh. I'm trying to, like, work up my slang game, because I want to be, like, cool and hip like you kids are. So, pretty fly, I think it's kind of, like, in my old time. Like, you know, if I say fly, people are like, hey, what are you talking about, grandpa? But if I say Gucci, I think Gucci is the, the big one now. Everything's pretty Gucci, dog. And I could just go ahead and slip in. <laughs> That's what goes through my mind. So, wife had... Yeah, so it does go ahead and um, reduce your stress a bit and also takes a bit of the thirst away, too. Cool. Alright, boy sleeping girl, what's your deal? You need to take a shower. It does seem you're, you're a stinky person. Go take a shower. And then... How's our water situation like? What? What is it? There's so much to do now that there's like four people in here and I gotta do the radio calls. Where's the water at? 8% contamination. I guess we could wait it out a bit longer. Anna's loyalty is almost there. Almost there. And the wife looking pretty good. And Boyo is about to wake his ass up. So hey, by the way, Anna. It does seem like you have to potty, so go ahead and use the toilet, but afterwards go back to training, because you and the boy are going out together. I need you to take care of him, okay? Because he happens to be a little bit of a small beta, that's all I can say. Medium office complex, examine the items. I'll take those coffee beans for some more coffee brewing. I'll uh, take those lens, I guess we'll take that. Metal's always- no, metal's always important. So we gotta bring that along. So, what's going away this time? What are we throwing away this time? Hmm... Again, we don't need plastic, so I can stay behind. Food-wise, carry you. Apparently I can. Okay. Girl, back to playing with some toys, getting smarter. I'm not sure what I want to do with the wife, meanwhile. Like, what should be her big focus? I guess you could go over here and water the plants, meanwhile. And I guess we'll incinerate some other stuff here, too. Make some more room, eventually. Um, <laughs> one match, huh? Yeah, go ahead and use the match. It does absolutely nothing for us. But let's go ahead and put all the coal in here. So we have to use any fuel for a while. Perfect. Some of your plant. No! No! <laughs> we were about to water them too. What are the odds? What are the odds? Oh, let's go water the plants. Oh, hey! Your plants died. On the way to you watering them. Okay, wife, stop it. There's there's nothing to water here. Can we... Oh, look at my plants. right there. They're dead. Can we zoom in on that? Look at that. They died. I'm a, I'm a terrible... Plant keeper, I guess, you know? Terrible gardener, herbalist. What are you going to say? I have a terrible Dr. Green Thumb. I guess Dr. Green Thumb was never really my thing, too, so. Uh, loyalty, looking pretty good, pretty stellar. Large house, examine the items. Okay. Oh, boy. I really, I still tell you right now, for the 1.7 update, I would love them to add, like, a feature down here where it says, like, pick up everything, and it'll pick up everything you already have in your inventory, so you don't have to, like, you know, go one by one, collecting the stuff that you want or need. Um, you know, nothing here stands out. At this point, I'm gonna go ahead and just start... Well, the wool actually is something we do need. But at this point, I'm gonna start leaving anything that doesn't really stand out. I started going by one one. I mean, we already have a lot of items as it is, so... Girl has increased her charisma. Well, girl, it's not about charisma, it's about intelligence, okay? So you continue getting some toys. Uh, stumble across some barracks. Ooh. That could be pretty cool. Anna, go back to training. Training. Boyo, train. And I guess you gotta wait for her to finish before you can train over there, too. Alrighty. Everything here seems to be fixed, though, right? I don't think there's anything else we can make as well. Unless I'm wrong about this. We have some dude. Shirtless guy. Really tanned. Blonde hair. If he was slightly balding, I would call him a Hulk Hogan, but, um, he's not. At least he seems like I have a pretty good set of hair on his head. He has, like, the entire Donald Trump thing happening up there, too. It's like a really buffed-up Donald Trump. Um, is there anything else we want to create, though? We already have solar panels up above. I guess people told me to make the jukebox. I guess we can do this just because we have the items for it, but do I really want to use up my switches for that? I mean, I guess I could. There's also the second recycling pen that we talked about. Eh, you know, I'm... At this point, like, I don't feel like items is really my, my worry, you know? And we haven't found one single special blueprint, which I'm so surprised, man. Like, my last run that we completed the game, I got, like, so many of them every single trip, it feels like I would get, like, one or two. This time, none. Absolutely none. I'm in day 85 and not one single special blueprint. It's really crazy when you think about it. Um, well, let's, 
Let's make the jukebox, I guess. Sure, why not? Rocking around, Christmas tree, let's put it up here. Up on the first floor, get some music up and make it very lively up above. Examine the items, ooh, the barracks have all the guns in the world. Not the guns, but the ammunition, which I guess technically would make sense as a barrack after all. So, obviously here what stands out is going to be that bullet, so we have to make room for that bullet, I guess. Um, okay, so you know what? Any more TVs to get rid of? No. So, radios are going away. Sorry to say, you gotta go. Alright. So, boyo, boyo. Train and train. Anna, you might as well get some sleep. Oh, this was a person coming after us after all. Girl, respond. This is Kevin. It's not Donald Trump or Hulk Hogan then, huh? Uh, I need some stuff retrieving. Could you help? I think there's a pr pretty dangerous type there already, so you might want to go in shooting? What? Is this like a quest? It's a quest, I think. Oh, boy. Accepted. I can handle myself, just make sure the pay is worth the effort. Oh, it'll be worth it for sure, I can't wait. I might be back later then. Oh, we have a quest! A quest that just rolled up into our front door, literally. Huh. Okay. Um, is this gonna be on my map somewhere? This might be like one of the things you tell me guys to be careful about. Like, um... Killer mobs with a bunch of guns, but I have a grenade for that. I have a couple of grenades, as a matter of fact. For that. Where, where's this at? Oh, all the way up here at the large factory. Well, this is awkward. Intriguing. So, wh where's? I mean, we gotta send Falcon and Susan out for that one, right? Are there any like scrapyards in the way over here? Because if not, I'm gonna recall you now. Oh, there's actually a small scrapyard right there. Okay, so after they're done through the scrapyard. We will recall them and send them out there as soon as possible. I mean, I could send the boy and Anna, but Anna's loyalty still needs a bit more working on, so we can't really send her out. Um, girl, let's have you go ahead and, like... More black rain, huh? Wow. It's a lot of that happening. Let's get you all situated here if we can, and my <laughs> jukebox is ready to go. How about that? Um, boyo, after you're done over there, get some water, and then we'll have you get some sleep afterwards. Uh, large police station. Okay. Ooh, another shoddy. I do want that. I do want that shoddy. So, uh, I don't think there's anything more we have to paint. To my knowledge. So, I guess we could just leave that. Oh, uh, I did say we want to get rid of those, though, huh? Yeah, that's fine. Gas mask. Uh, I feel like we have a lot of those, too, huh? Let's just do it this way. Okay. Um, and, uh, right, right, right. Wifey. Get some food. And girl, what's your deal? You're getting some water? After the water, I guess you might want to potty, get some sleep. And boyo, it's time for you to get some sleep as well. Anna's up and running again. Go train and train what? A ferocious looking creature. No, no, you won't deal with that. I will. Fast wolf. Every time that wolf rolls up on me, it just, it freaks me out because, like, it just rolls up, like, really, really fast. Like, like the bear at least kind of, like, trots over, but the wolf is kind of, like, he's like a flash, dude. All up in your grill. All right, Susan. I don't trust Susan for this, you know? I'll be honest with you. So, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna shoot. Susan, you and this shotgun is just a terrible combination. I thought your dexterity was high. I'm pretty sure dexterity stat uh, is the one that you have to worry about for... Landing shots. I'm gonna give the handgun back to you because you and the shotgun are just not really working out too well. And then Falcon Stress is about to go off the chain here, too. Ugh. I'm sorry, Bird Man. Just tough it out, buddy. Okay? It's alright, it's just a wolf man. Not, not literally a wolf man, like a woo. You know, it's a full moon, I gotta turn into a wolf. But you, you know what I mean, okay? Don't, don't get smart with me. Ah, uh, we don't need that stuff. Trauma. Don't. Don't you dare. Stop right there. Okay, that's not too bad. Okay, no more killing for Falcon. Like, for for real. <laughs> for real this time. No more killing for Falcon. It's out of control. So I'm turning him into a monster, man. And monster man, not literally like a monster. Yeah, you, you know, you know what I mean. It's monster, comma, man. Like wolf, comma, man, okay? That's what I was going for here. Uh girl. That's all she's doing, getting some rest. I guess when you wake up, get a toy, get smarter again, and it's just training. Wifey, you know what? Let's just get your rest now. 
Get that out of the way. Transmission. Items at the church. I'll take that and that. Eh, everything else could practically stay. I guess pipes are always important, right? Okay. So that's done. We have two people here. Let's just speed it up if we can. So your dexterity increased, Anna. Good. So I guess we probably should have Susan hit the punching bag a bit so she could get more accurate with that shotgun. Because I would love to use the shotgun, but she keeps missing all the time. But the training bag will be for strength and dexterity. So that's two, a two-pronged effect, it does seem. Alright. I guess we can do that. I like how everybody's asleep, minus Anna. Anna is going to get some water on her own. Anna, is the water okay? It's a 6%, you're fine. Anna, be careful when you're drinking the water when there's black rain up above, okay? I don't trust you. There's people at the medium house. Why well, I gotta get involved? <laughs> I don't trust you guys for that. It's one person wearing an Indiana Jones cap. Hey, buddy, don't you walk on by. <laughs> Whoa, easy there. Looking for a place to crash, are you? Uh, I'm sorry to say, rejected. Your stats aren't even that good, Jennifer. And I don't really like you yelling at me, saying, hey, buddy, because it sounds very condescending. You know how I know that? Because I say, hey, buddy, all the time to condescend to myself. So I know how the condescending, hey, buddies work. And that's a condescending, hey, buddy, right there. Ooh, a switch. Yeah, I want that. Uh, I'll take those coffee beans. That's really all there is. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. what is it? Huh? What do you want up here, huh? What are you busting my, my doorbell for, Jeffrey? I've just had a close call with a group of mutants. I can't run. You want to trade? Is that really the first thing that should be in your mind at the moment when you're being chased by mutants? Trading? Speaking of mutants... There's no mutants in the game, are there? You know, if the people in the, uh, in the skirt outskirts say mutants all the time, why haven't we seen mutants in the game? They should add mutants to the game. I know it's supposed to be more realistic than anything else, but... They say mutants all the time. Give me a couple of mutants, I'm down with it. Ooh, more valves. I think we needed that for something else, too. Um, at this point, I guess I'll just... Take all of that. And what am I going to give you? Oh, well, water. It's raining, after all. I got all the water in the world. There you go, Jeffrey. Good luck with them mutants, huh? He's literally talking about the X-Men, too. I was being chased by Logan out there. By Wolverine. Check it out. Okay. Um, girl. Get a toy. Anna. It seems like um, you probably take that shower now. And then get some sleep. Wife seems to be pretty good. Maybe use the toilet if you can. And Boyo, you need to use that toilet too, don't you? Yeah, you do. I've seen that look before. <laughs> when you gotta go, you gotta go. Uh, can't even stack more of those. I'll take that though. Take that. And anything else here that stands out? Oh, the switch. Oh my god, we're coming up on these switches like crazy now. I'm happy about that. Confirm. Alright, let's see. Doing a bunch of stuff here. Wife's using the restroom. Boyo, I guess we have to wait for your mom to get out first, huh? Oh yeah, I made this jukebox and I haven't even used it. There's three records in there. I guess we'll play it right now before we wrap up, because we're out of time with this video too, it does seem. So Boyo, use the toilet. Wife, you want to come up here and take a gander? Play some music! Go ahead, let's see what happens. It's really lively up there too. We have a captured elk. There's people walking by, another elk over there running off. There's a lot of stuff happening up above right now. Got some coffee here waiting for us too. Yeah! Uh, let's see what this music does. Do we actually hear music? Oh god, we do. <laughs> it sounds like music you would hear, like, in the 80s coming into, like, a, a news broadcast or something. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there's nothing here that I really want. Whatever, get out of there. Listen to that. It's actually kind of cool. Yeah. It actually sounds pretty good. It's really catchy. You know, I grew up towards the late... Well, actually, I was born towards the end of the 80s. So I still heard a lot of the 80s growing up as a youngling, you know? And that right there really resonates to me as, you know, Grandpa Falcon. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, again, we'll continue going forward. Next episode, once we hit the scrapyard with Falcon, I'm going to recall them. And hopefully Anna's already loyal by then. We can send two parties out and we're going to aim for the quest marker that we got. And then we're only aiming for scrapyards afterwards, so we could get the parts of the vehicle and wrap that up. So we're about to focus in on our objective next episode around. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will catch you next time.